Welcome back to Jersey Matters. Helping people with developmental disabilities find meaningful employment. That's the mission of our next guest. Josh Borstein is Director of Special Projects at Union County Educational Services Commission and Project Search at Overlook Medical Center. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for so having me. So we're that. talking about Project Search. What is it? Project Search is a one-year uh, intensive job skills training program for students ages 18 to 21 with developmental or intellectual disabilities, including autism. Um, we work with the local school districts to identify students that would be appropriate for the program. Uh, and then we place them inside of a major business here in New Jersey for a full year where they get the chance to rotate through three different internship experiences, uh, 90 minutes of classroom instruction a day. And our goal is to help them understand and learn what is it like and what does it take to be a good employee and hopefully they take away skills that can help them get a job. So is anyone that meets that age requirement that's within that age that has a developmental disability eligible for this? Uh, as long as they're still a part of their local school district, that's the key. Um, we're, we're taking advantage of funding that is, is there through school districts, um, and we need school districts to decide, you know, which students really would benefit from this. Who are those kids that really need this kind of intensive uh, and immersion style experience to help them get over the hump and, uh, and enter the workforce? So then once, once a person, once a child is identified, what happens then? What do you do? Uh, we bring them in for an interview and assessment experience on site uh, at that local business. Uh, we talk to them a little bit about the expectations. Uh, we want to make sure that the student ultimately, more than anything, has the desire to work, uh, that the family is supportive of that, and that we feel as though they would benefit from this program. We don't want students that are already on their way towards getting a job. We want kids who really need this type of an experience to help make the difference for them in, in terms of securing competitive employment. It is incredible that, uh, that there's some tasks, many tasks as a matter of fact, that someone with autism excels at, does better than the general population. Many tasks, many jobs that people with other developmental disabilities actually do better than the general population and that's been, analytics have shown that. Absolutely, and you know I think it's it's so important because there's there's a lot of great programs out there that are supporting people with disabilities to get work, um, but the outcomes just aren't there. You know, um, in some cases they are, but overall they're not where they need to be. Um, so it's very important that we raise the bar, that we raise expectations, um, that we really look at the strengths of the individual. A program like Project Search, which fortunately you know is supported by New Jersey's Department of Labor and Workforce Development and the Division of Vocational Rehabilitation Services, um, is, is putting some funding into this and supporting this model, which is different. Um, is, and is a real collaborative model that's bringing together schools when kids are at that real critical stage, that last year of high school where they need that support to bridge into adult life, but we're also bringing in state agencies that are going to end up working with them. And obviously the most important player is the private sector, these big businesses um, that, are, that are allowing us to come inside their doors um, and use their environment as a, as a classroom um, to train these students. Now for, for teachers, for school administrators, for parents of children with developmental disabilities for businesses that want to get involved with this how do they get a hold of you uh, the first thing they can do is just go to our website at www.projectsearch.us. Uh, there's an opportunity there to find a program uh, in your area. Uh, we currently have seven programs in New Jersey in four different counties. Uh, hopefully there's one that's in, in their proximity. Uh, we are hoping to grow. Uh, we're going to be adding a couple more counties next year uh, and then hopefully a couple more the year following. But go to the website. That's a great starting point. Um, they can always sort of reach out through there to help find And it's important program. to point out you do have a track record. You're new to New Jersey, but you're not new to the business or the mission. That is true. Project Search started in 1996 at Cincinnati Children's uh, Hospital and Medical Center. So this model has been operating successfully for over 20 years, uh, relatively new to New Jersey, starting in 2016 at Overlook Medical Center in Summit. Um, but, you know, our outcomes are there. Um, so for schools and businesses, you have proof of performance. Seventy percent of our graduates of this program have secured paid employment uh, competitively in the community and when you compare that to the national average of employment for people with disabilities which is still unfortunately hovering around 25 percent it's pretty significant wonderful thank thanks, you for coming Larry. in thanks for having us best of luck josh borstein is the director of special projects at union county educational services commission and project search at overlook medical center jersey matters continues right after this still to come my commentary on the government shutdown when Jersey Matters continues.